there, fellow crafters. Let's have some fun with fashion. Barbie needs new outfits for school, and we love making her new clothes. But first, make sure to show us some love by subscribing, hitting the notification bell, and clicking the thumbs up button if you like this video. Now let's create our very own project runway for Barbie. Prepare your patterns. When making clothes for any size, you need to have a pattern before you cut out the material. Here's an example pattern that's super easy to make. Feel free to pause the video and use these pieces as a guideline to make your own pattern. You'll want to measure the patterns to the size of your doll. Now grab a full leather material for Barbie's leather jacket. Pin your pattern onto the material, making sure to pin the piece for the back of the jacket on the fold. Trace the patterns with chalk. Now you should have the front, back, sleeves, and collar. Sew the front and back together, starting with the shoulders. Flip the front pieces over so that the jacket is inside out. This will ensure that the seams don't show when it's right side out. Next, you'll want to add her sleeves. Sew the sleeves on so it looks like this. Then turn the jacket inside out again and sew the sleeves up underneath. While you're at it, sew the side seams to the jacket too. It's really coming together. The next step is to glue the collar pieces together so they look the same on both sides. Sew the collar onto the jacket like you see here. This jacket is done! Pretty cool, right? Let's make Barbie some overalls out of her old jeans. Cut these patterns for her legs and sew the material. You may need to use a straw or a chopstick to push it right side out. Sew the legs together at the top. Then fold the fabric and glue it at the waist. Add a piece of Velcro to fasten the pants. You know that small pocket in the front of your jeans? We're gonna use it for Barbie's overall bib. Cut it out and measure it to Barbie's torso. Then cut it to size. This is gonna be so cute. Hem the bottom of the bib with hot glue. Then use the seam of your old pants as straps for Barbie's new overalls. Hot glue the straps into place at the front. Then crisscross the straps at the back. Hot glue them into place too. Congratulations! You just made adorable overalls! Seriously, we can't get over how cute these are! Add the jacket and check out this stylish doll. Now let's make Barbie a dress. For this, you're gonna need some white jersey fabric, some black jersey fabric, some black lace, and a strip of Velcro. Place Barbie on top of the black jersey fabric to measure the length of the skirt. Mark the pattern line and cut out your skirt fabric. Measure the skirt around Barbie's hips and legs and trim the fabric to fit. And now for the top part of the dress. Fold your white jersey fabric in half, then fold it again. Measure the material to Barbie's torso. Make marks around Barbie's body so you know how much material you'll need. Then cut out the shirt. Make sure to cut out an opening for her neck too. Now open up the fabric. You'll need to sew up the size of the shirt, which is super easy to do. Cut the shirt down the middle to make an opening in the back. Now we're going to sew the top of the dress to the bottom half. Snip off the corners of the skirt at the top and sew the dress together. After you've got the shirt sewn to the skirt, sew the skirt closed in the back.
Then glue in two small strips of Velcro to fasten the blouse together. Next, we're going to cut out two pieces of lace to go around the collar. Just glue them in place. Once the glue dries, let Barbie try on her new dress. This is a super sophisticated look. Now Barbie needs a party outfit. Grab some more faux leather, but let's use brown this time. Measure and cut out a wide belt for her waist. Cut out a piece for the skirt and glue it onto the belt, gathering the fabric every half inch or so. This will give her skirt a pleated look. Add two small strips of Velcro so you can fasten the skirt in the back. Now let's make her a jacket. Trace the shape of the jacket against Barbie's body. Make sure the fabric is folded twice. Then cut out the shape. If you're sick of sewing, here's a quick shortcut. Just hot glue the jacket together at the seams. When the glue dries, flip the sweater right side out. Now you've got a cozy, oversized sweater for Barbie. Next, we're going to make her some leg warmers out of an old glove. Snip the first two fingers off the glove. Then hold them together and cut the tops off to make them even. Did you know you could also use gloves to make a knitted jacket? Here's how we did it. Draw a line along the glove like this. Snip the tip off of the thumb of the glove. Do this with both gloves. Then hot glue the pieces together at the seams. Fold the thick collar part of the jacket over and glue it. Now Barbie is dressed for the fall party. She looks casually cozy, right? And here she is in her oversized sweater for her coffee dates. Want to learn how to make this gorgeous dress for Barbie? Check it out! Grab a piece of plaid fabric and measure it to fit Barbie. Pin it into place and send Barbie off to study while we make her outfit. Trim away the extra fabric and glue in the edges. Sew the dress together at the seam. Then flip it right side out. Let's try this on, Barbie. Now you'll need a black, wide elastic band. Fold it in half and measure it to Barbie's waist. Cut off the extra elastic and sew it together to make her a belt. That's all there is to it. Making doll clothes is so much fun, isn't it? Now we've got one more awesome outfit for you to try. It's this fabulous zipper dress that will definitely elevate Barbie's fashion game. Are you ready? For this, we're going to use an old sock. Kind of looks like a sweater, right? Measure the sock to Barbie's body, placing the toe of the sock on her neck. Cut the sock at Barbie's knees. Then mark the place for her neck and arms. Fold the sock in half and cut out the marks we made for her neck and arms. Next, trim a zipper to fit the dress. Cut the front of the dress open so you can put the zipper inside. But first, try the dress on Barbie and cut away any excess fabric. Pin it into place so it's easy to trim.
Once the glue is dry, Barbie can wear her gorgeous sweater dress anywhere. Can you believe this came from an old sock? This is a beautiful fashion show. We say you all are the winners of Barbie Project Runway, the back to school edition. And thanks for watching Crafty Hackers. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more crafty hacks and ideas. Catch you later.